I'm Michelle Linden Mayer and in this video I'm going to be showing you how to make three dimensional flowers. Purchasing manufactured embellishments for your pages can be very costly and it can be hard to find exactly what you need. You can make them yourself and be sure that you're going to have the perfect match for your page or project. What you'll need. You'll need a piece of patterned paper with different size flowers on it, some blossoms or paper flowers, some small buttons, a glue stick, some glue dots and a pair of scissors. Take your patterned paper and use scissors to cut out several different size flowers. How many you cut out will depend on how many you would like to make. To make one completed flower you'll need three or four flowers. Here are some flowers that I've cut out from the patterned paper. If you're not confident in cutting out shapes or flowers using scissors, please see my video on how to cut shapes from patterned paper using scissors. You will start with your largest flower on the bottom. Choose the next largest flower. Take a glue dot and place it underneath. You'll then need to stick that flower on top of the larger flower. You'll need to repeat this step for your other flowers. Some of the reasons I love using glue dots are that they are easy to use, they aren't messy and they give great dimension. Now place your smallest flower on the top. To finish off your flower, you can adhere a button to your flower by applying a small amount of glue with a glue stick. A little tip, if you don't want your flowers to look too bulky, you could simply use some glue or other adhesive in between your flowers. This would still give you a dimensional look but without the bulk. Happy scrapping! <laughs>